Drones are getting increasingly popular. You see them almost every single day. They're so popular that you might not know when one is watching you. Well, anybody can legally have a drone. And that's a concern many in the community have. What if one gets into the wrong hands? Adam Andrews with Airworks Production says most people are using them for good. Right now, a lot of people are using them for filmmaking, for taking stills and video, but uh, they're being used in farming, search and rescue, police work. Drone owner Don Line agrees. I was looking for a part-time business, something I could do in my spare time, and it seemed like something I could do, and I had already had an aviation background. The biggest problem, misuse. A lot of people are getting these for Christmas, they're getting them, they're buying them on Amazon and other places and they don't know the limitations, so we're, we're trying to educate the public on the safe uses of them. Here's the three main FAA regulations drone pilots must follow. Don't fly above 400 feet, don't fly above a crowd of people unless they're aware of it, and don't fly around uh, an airport. And in Wisconsin, if there's an expectation of privacy, it's also a no-go. We don't want to be flying over someone's backyard. They're laying out at the pool. We're scared about privacy concerns, um, you know, which is really a, a kind of a mute point in our world because they're very loud. I mean, they don't they don't make good spy machines. And, and I'm always there with the, 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 the property owner, the guy that's hiring me to do the um, pictures or take to take the videos. With more and more uses for the drones, it's likely you'll see one in your future. Reporting from Kenosha, April Devorney, CBS 58 News.